Australians, oh let us rejoice for we are young and free. Stop, stop, no you can't say young anymore. Young has been changed to one, for we are one and free. I'll let Prime Minister Scott Morrison explain why we changed it. During the past year, we have showed once again the indomitable spirit of Australians and the united effort that has always enabled us to prevail as a nation. It is time to ensure this great unity is reflected more fully in our national anthem. Also, while Australia as a modern nation may be relatively young, our country's story is ancient, as are the stories of the many First Nations peoples whose stewardship we rightly acknowledge and respect. In the spirit of unity, it is only right that we ensure our our national anthem reflects this truth and shared appreciation. Aboriginal spokesman and professional boxer Anthony Mundine, okay, I don't know if he's an official spokesman, but he is Aboriginal and he does speak, he said these words about the new word change. One word ain't going to change the core meaning of a song. It's always going to be a white supremacy song until the whole song is rewritten. Still ain't good enough. You see, the problem with these song lyrics is that they are subjective. They're based on personal feelings, tastes or opinions. What we really need to do to make sure that everyone is happy is to remove all subjectivity. We need to make them objective. I'm a maths guy, so I reckon if we change these lyrics to statements of fact, then we'll be one step closer to appeasing the mob. I reckon we go with the new lyrics, we keep the word one, but I reckon the word free is too subjective. I mean, what does it mean? Does it mean free as in freedom, or free as in free beer? It's confusing, so I reckon we change it to three. For we are one and three. It's better, but doesn't make much sense. So using my maths background, we just change four to the numeral four, then we change we are to equals. Let's face it, Australia is all about equality. And then we change the word and to plus. Australians, all oh, let us rejoice, four equals one plus three. Perfect. Completely objective. Nobody can argue with this. It's just a statement of fact. Four does indeed equal one plus three. So not only do we get rid of all the racial undertones of our national anthem, we also teach our children basic maths. It's a win-win. So what do you reckon, Anthony? Do you like my new lyrics? Love them, mate, but I thought 1 plus 3 equals 13.